Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a groundbreaking treatment for chronic autoimmune conditions affecting millions of people. Tremphia, also known by its generic name, Guselkumab. Psoriasis is a chronic autoimmune disorder causing overproduction of skin cells, leading to inflamed red plaques that cause pain and itching. Over 7.5 million Americans are affected, with 20% experiencing severe cases that impact quality of life. Another related condition is psoriatic arthritis, or PSA, characterized by joint inflammation, dactylitis, and axial pain. PSA often appears between ages 30 and 50, with genetic, immune, and environmental factors believed to play roles. Enter Tremphia. Approved by the FDA in July 2017 for moderate to severe plaque psoriasis in adults, Tremphia was further approved in July 2020 for treating adults with active psoriatic arthritis, bringing new hope to many sufferers. So, how does Tremphia work? Tremphia is a human monoclonal antibody targeting interleukin-23, IL-23, a cytokine involved in inflammatory responses, helping reduce the release of pro-inflammatory cytokines and chemokines central to psoriasis and psoriatic arthritis. The effectiveness of Tremphia was demonstrated in several studies, including the Orion study for plaque psoriasis and the DISCOVER-1 and DISCOVER-2 trials for psoriatic arthritis. The Orion study showed that at week 16, 81% of patients using Tremphia achieved an investigator's global assessment score of 0 or 1. Additionally, 76% achieved a psoriasis area and severity index 90 response, indicating a 90% improvement in symptoms. For psoriatic arthritis, the DISCOVER trials were equally impressive. At 24 weeks, 52% to 64% of patients treated with Tremphia achieved the primary endpoint of ACR20, compared to only 22% to 33% in the placebo groups. Tremphia also improved physical functioning and fatigue. Now, let's talk about how Tremphia is administered. Tremphia is given as a 100 mg subcutaneous injection every eight weeks after starter doses at weeks zero and four. For active psoriatic arthritis, it can be used alone or with a conventional disease-modifying anti-rheumatic drug. One of the notable advancements is the patient-controlled injector, allowing patients to self-inject after proper training and physician approval, giving them more control over their treatment, making it more convenient and accessible. As with any medication, there are important warnings and precautions to consider. Tremphia is contraindicated for patients with a history of serious hypersensitivity reactions to guselkumab or any of its excipients. Tremphia may also increase the risk of infection, so it's crucial to evaluate patients for tuberculosis, TB, prior to starting treatment. If a serious infection develops, Tremphia should be discontinued until the infection is resolved. Before starting Tremphia, Evaluate patients for tuberculosis and treat any latent infections. Monitor for signs of active TB during and after treatment and avoid administering Tremphia to patients with active TB. Ensure all recommended immunizations are completed before initiating Tremphia and avoid using live vaccines during treatment. The most common adverse reactions with Tremphia include upper respiratory infections, headaches, injection site reactions, joint pain, bronchitis, diarrhea, gastroenteritis, tinea infections, and herpes simplex infections. Patients should report any side effects promptly. Tremphia has proven to be a highly effective treatment option for both moderate to severe plaque psoriasis and active psoriatic arthritis, offering hope for better symptom management and improved quality of life. If you think Tremphia might be right for you, consult your healthcare provider to discuss the potential benefits and risks. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on the latest treatments and innovations in healthcare. See you next time.